thousands of elephants live, not in the wild, but in captivity, enslaved by humans. Used for elephant back safaris and as performers, sadistically trained to break their wild spirit and ridden for human entertainment. Shackled in spiked chains their entire life to prevent escape, unable to fill their basic needs. This is the story of a visionary who is changing culture and practices that have brutalized elephants for centuries. And she's doing it one elephant at a time. As a young college student, Carol Buckley met Tara, a recently captured baby elephant who was kept on display outside a Southern California tire store and forced to live in the back of a truck. This meeting was the beginning of a profound relationship and lifelong journey. Fast forward 20 years. Carol always wanted more for Tara. The solution? Create an elephant sanctuary where Tara and Carol could grow their family by providing refuge for needy elephants from zoos and circuses. Their new home would soon be internationally recognized as the foremost natural habitat refuge for endangered elephants. But Carol didn't stop there. Painfully aware of the monumental suffering of captive-held elephants in Asia, Carol founded Elephant Aid International and is once again making a difference, a big difference. In Southeast Asia, Carol is working with elephant trainers, elephant owners and governments to change the brutal culture that has enslaved elephants for hundreds of years. Already, she has brought about sustainable welfare improvements for elephants forced to live in captivity. Providing elephant pedicures to prevent the onset of osteomyelitis, a life-threatening disease caused by lack of exercise and standing chained for long hours in their own excrement. Educating Mahouts, the elephant trainers, about compassionate elephant care, a positive way of caring for elephants, teaching them new methods to replace the traditional practice of using physical pain, fear, domination, and punishment to control their elephants. And dispelling the myth that physical freedom will result in havoc. Carol's answer? The chain-free means pain-free project. Removing leg chains that for decades have shackled elephants to the ground, enslaving them. Physical freedom. Spacious, chain-free corrals for all elephants. And it's working. Nepal and Thailand are the first to experience the cultural shift. Chain-free corrals are being built for working elephants in national parks, elephant hospitals, and elephant sanctuaries. All places that before chained elephants for up to 17 hours every day. Oh, you're okay, you're okay. He just woke up, he's a little tired. That's what it does. Yeah. When you say to the elephant to back up, you say, Kit? Kit. Good job. Okay, all done. You guys did good. Side. Good boy. Good boy. In learning about their elephants and how they can improve their lives, Mahouts are gaining confidence and a voice. And the elephants? Hardwired to benefit from a natural setting, free to forage, socialize, and experience autonomy, the elephants flourish. When released from chains, elephants of all ages display an outpouring of emotion and play behavior never before observed by their mahouts. If you would like to be a part of this revolutionary movement, if you would like to change hearts and minds and make a lasting difference in the lives of working elephants, call, email or visit our website.
and please don't forget to like us on Facebook.